this video, we'll demonstrate using LoRa to transmit over the air using the Lime SDR as both a client and a relay station. And from my backyard now, I have the client app running on my laptop with the Lime SDR in the acrylic case. To show the screen here, you can see an incrementing count. That count is being generated by the laptop and sent through the relay and back to this machine. So if we go over to the tab here. We can see the signal generator, we can disable that, and now it's just relying on the chat box. So you go back to the display, we type in a message, hello, we get it over here, send through the relay and onto the receiving end. And here we have the relay side, this is the Lime SDR in custom case. And here we have the relay app running and you can see the same count sent by the transmitter is being received going over to the um, receive and transmit chains we can see that the decoder path is looped back into the encoder so anything we received is transmitted back out and that's how the relay works this is the topology for a relay application it consists of an SDR source, demodulator, and decoder anything received over the decoder is looped back into the encoder to be remodulated and transmitted back out under a different frame synchronization ID. Now this is the topology for the client. It's very similar to the relay, however, the IDs are reversed and there's no loopback path. It also makes use of a test signal generator so we can walk around and generate and see our uh, relayed messages without having to constantly type and it has chat boxes in and out which we can see here so we can type in the box of transmit messages and we can see in the other box receive messages from the relay.